In the southwest, the Yoruba. Fishermen, boatmen, farmers. They have a long and cruel history of civil war, in which whole districts were devastated and their inhabitants massacred and enslaved. Now their chiefs rule peacefully with British advice. Their capital, Ibadan, is the largest Negro city in Africa. But deep in the interior, old habits and old beliefs are still strong. Distances and lack of communication sharpen the isolation of tribe from tribe and are at the bottom of Nigeria's disunity. The railways, overworked and short of rolling stock, are unable to carry all the food and produce that might be going to the port. Too much of the land is worn out. Primitive agriculture and a population growing too 